today we're going to learn how to find median. So usually we're going to divide the graph into halves. So it's either we integrate from A until M, we write median as M. Or we can also find from M until P because that is actually half. Alright, so we're going to look at the, the example. Right, find the cumulative distribution and then sketch the graph, calculate the probability and lastly we're going to find the median. Okay, to find the cumulative, we have one function. So we're going to write as in table like this. For the intervals, we have less than zero. So that will be no function. We're going to integrate from z negative infinity until x. The function is zero. And that will get gives us zero. Next, we bring f zero. We're going to substitute zero since that is no function. So we're going to integrate zero until x for the interval zero until four, and then integrate one over eight x. We will get x squared over two. Substitute x. Okay. Then we get the function. For cumulative, that one is x squared over 16. Bring forward to the next column, then we substitute 4 into the function x squared over 16. And then plus with 4 until x, the function 0. Lastly, we get equals to 1. Now, that is the cumulative. For all this, we're going to write it back into cumulative distribution function. So that will be capital letter F or at less than 0, the function is also 0. 0 until 4 and then more than 4. Make sure to get the last one equals to 1 for cumulative. Okay, now we're going to sketch the graph. Substitute the values F4 into the function will get equals to 1. So since that is continuous, that will be the same value. Now sketch for y axis represents capital F and then the x axis now 0 to 4 4 is actually 1 so we are going to sketch the quadratic graph and then more than 4 is 1 less than 0 is also 0 alright to calculate the probability from 2 until 3 we have using the cumulative we just substitute F3 minus F2 because we already have the cumulative so we're going to just use it and then less than 3 minus 2 because we're going to find from 2 until 3 only so we're going to substitute the values for F3 into the function that we already integrate just now and then we calculate we get 9 over 16 minus 4 over 16 5 over 16 Right. To find the median, we need to divide the graphs into halves. This is like 0 0.5. So we just substitute x with m because we're going to find the median. So that will be m squared over 16 equals to half. Then we calculate m. Since m we get two values, we are going to verify which m that we actually want to find because it's supposed to be from 0 until 4. So m is between 0 to 4 that means m is 2.82 okay we can use pdf instead of cumulative so let's say we're going to sketch the graph to see where is actually m so m is actually like half of the graph so it's between 0 to 4 so we're going to integrate from 0 until m Substitute a function then equals to 0 0.5 because it's actually half, right? Median is half. Then we integrate, substitute m into x. Then we are going to get m two values. We choose m between 0 to 4. So m will be 2.82. Okay. You can try to do this exercise question. And this is the answer.